Oh, Daddy. Hello again. Welcome to another Moff Dad Minecraft tutorial. In today's video, we're going to make jack-o'-lanterns. It's a simple process, but takes a couple steps. Let's get started. All right, down here is the new expansion I made of our pumpkin farm. And to make jack-o'-lanterns, you first have to get carved pumpkins. So we have our shears here, and you shear the pumpkin just like this. You don't actually have to pick the pumpkin before you shear it, but uh, you can do that too. So I'm going to start shearing all of these. If I just run like this, I'm shearing all the pumpkins into carved pumpkins. Jack-o'-lanterns are great for making iron golems and snow golems. And they put off 15 luminance, which is a great light source, and you can also put them under water for lighting. Okay, so I just sheared these two rows, so let's break these now. And it's a two-step process. First, you use your shears to carve them into carved pumpkins, and then you go to your crafting table and you craft them with torches and make jack-o'-lanterns. So we're going to take our 64 carved pumpkins, our 64 torches, and we're going to make 64 jack-o'-lanterns. Perfect. So now we have jack-o'-lanterns. So you can place them and you can see they put up really great light source. Let's go down here. I'll show you more of our expansion. Here's our expansion we did under our pumpkin patch. It's a pretty good expansion, but as you can see here, these do not have enough light to grow. So if I come up here and place a jack-o'-lantern, these now will hopefully grow. So my plan is, is to take these jack-o'-lanterns and use them to light this farm. I will take out my existing lighting setup and use jack-o'-lanterns, which will put off more light, and they're much easier to place than using four torches. And let's go put them underwater to see how they do. We can come under here, place the jack-o'-lantern, and now you can see it's nice and lit. So we can come up here, maybe we'll place one right in here, do one on the other side, and now whoop, we need air. Now as you see down there, it's lit, and at nighttime it'll be nice and lit under our bridge. Our neighbor over here let us build a bridge to them, and they also wanted me to expand our sugarcane farm over to their home too. So we're sharing this sugarcane farm and we will use these to light pretty much most of our base now. And it's a pretty simple process. You just carve the pumpkin, use them in the crafting table, and you have jack-o'-lanterns. So a carved pumpkin looks very similar to a jack-o'-lantern just without the light source. So if you're going to do it, you might as well put the light in it because it's easy, you get more light, and it also looks really cool. In our next video, we will be lighting our base. Instead of subscribing to another YouTube channel, get outside and get some fresh air. Maybe go for a bike ride. Thank you for watching.